If you are watching this video, it means you, just like me, have been searching the internet for answers on why you cannot purchase a subscription in the Turkish PlayStation Store. In this video, I will explain you why you cannot do it and suggest what you can do in this situation. But before we start, please like this video and subscribe to the channel. I will share my own story on what I did to finally purchase a subscription. First, let me clarify that I had no issues buying games, but I couldn't purchase a subscription. I kept encountering various errors, so I naturally turned to Google to find solutions. Google provided me many suggestions, but as usual, they were mostly unhelpful, like deleting the console or re-adding the credit debit card. I even tried contacting people who bought games and subscriptions with Turkish accounts, but they didn't want to share any information with me, and finally I found someone who was able to explain what was I doing wrong. This person explained that I would never be able to buy a subscription for one simple reason. The Turkish PlayStation Store recently banned purchasing subscriptions with the virtual credit cards. You can still buy games with virtual cards, but not subscriptions. Actually, they made this obviously because many people created virtual credit cards and purchase volumes increased significantly in Turkish PS Store. And in the future, they may limit not only the possibility to buy subscriptions, but to use the virtual credit debit cards at all. So the only way to purchase a subscription is with a physical card. However, since I couldn't get a physical card, the question then is is what can you do in this situation. I suggest using the services of intermediaries. For some certain commission they can buy a Turkish PS Store subscription. But I highly recommend you to apply it to the intermediaries which has a good reputation, as you will have to provide them with all your account data, and they might stall your account if they want to. But if you don't have nothing valuable on your Turkish account, you can provide intermediaries with a fresh account to buy a PlayStation subscription, so there will be nothing to steal. But always remember that using intermediaries might be against Sony's rules and you might receive a ban on your PlayStation. But still, that's how I finally got my subscription. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel or share this video with your friends who might also be facing difficulties with purchasing from the Turkish PlayStation Store. He or she will at least will understand what is happening and try to comment below this video if you want me to make a video about intermediary services.